As we all know, IIT recently changed its eligibility criteria, now allowing students up to 25 years to appear for this exam. This is for general candidates. There is a special 5-year relaxation for students of the SC, ST, PWD category. Hi, I'm Shreyam Banerjee, a CMI alumnus. And if you're a PCB student who is struggling in these last three months, thinking about which chapters of maths are we supposed to do now because there's so little time left, then this video is for you. So in this video, I'm going to tell you which are the easiest and the most boring chapters in maths which you can prepare in these three months and get good marks, all right? So starting off with, these are the chapters you should not be missing, okay? Because these are essentially free marks, okay? You barely need to put in any effort and you'll get free marks from these chapters, all right? So the first chapter is basic maths, okay? So topics like logarithms, graphs, and transformations are very simple, okay? You just go through them once and you'll be able to solve the questions, right? Coming to sets, relations, and functions, number of relations, all about functions. These are very common chapters. Every year, there's some variant of these chapters coming, right? So this is another chapter you should not be missing. When it comes to limits, Normal algebraic limits, L'Hopital rule, limits as integrals, these are all standard formulas. So as long as you remember those basic four or five formulas, you'll be able to solve these questions. Even after this, if you talk about AOD, right? Just finding maxima and minima is a very common question, right? And you just need to look at the derivative, right? So these are the things you should not be missing, right? Matrices, equation solving, and other basic properties of matrices. Coming to definite integrals, there are only four or five major techniques, right? So do all of them. Coordinate geometry, straight line, circles, parabola, and finding locus, right? Even if you struggle with other topics like ellipses and hyperbolas, make sure straight lines, circles and parabola, these three chapters you should not be missing out, right? Then we talk about vectors, triple products, geometric significance, these are all standard formulas. Progressions, this is one chapter which is very scoring because you know there are only three formulas you need to know, right? So progressions, AP, GP, HP, you need to know all these. Talk about inequalities, sum of series, easy chapters, right? Okay. If you have extra time, once you're done with this, so this is your first step, right? Once you're done with these chapters, if you still have some extra time and your other subjects are well prepared, then you can go for these chapters, right? Talk about indefinite integrals. We know you have to mug up a lot of formulas. There are different techniques, right? This comes under that category, okay? Same goes for hyperbola, binomial theorem, complex numbers, there are different variants. There's geometry of complex numbers, algebraic properties of complex numbers. So these are slightly longer chapters, right? So you need more time, you have to prepare a lot, you have to remember a lot, right? So once you're done with that, then you can approach these topics. But these are also just slightly harder than them. But if you have time, please do go for these chapters, right? So hopefully this helps you. So these extra four or five questions that you do, that 20 marks can make a huge boost in your rank, right? So make sure you do not mess out on these chapters. So these are some general tips and advices for you guys. If you have more questions, do reach out to us on the Sayastra app. We also have our very own Kalam batch, which is taught in English, where we have doubt solving sessions, where we address all the problems that you might have in these chapters, right? We're going to launch a crash course for the Kalam batch very soon. So please do check that out in the description. Mm -hmm.